Listen up, I'm Brian Pond. Amanda. And this is Take Me Out Food Reviews. We have once again gone to Freddy's. And they got they got some propaganda here. Let's see what we got they got them saying. Let's see, Freddy's proudly served served his country and still does today. Like so many World War II veterans, Freddy doesn't just believe in the uh, core American values like kindness, respect, and honor. He lives those values every day. That's what makes visiting Freddy's so memorable. Sure, the food is delicious, but it's the whole experience that makes Freddy's unique. The uh, Freddy factor is unmistakable as employees show genuine attention to detail, take pride in their work, and go out of their way to make, make sure... Make you uh, feel right at home. You see, Freddy's military service may have ended decades ago, but his customer service is still going strong. All right, that's cute. I'm a I'm a Navy veteran as well, so I do respect that. And he's a World War II veteran, so no, yeah. There we go. So yeah, that's 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 a cool thing. I, I like the idea, idea of a uh, World War II veteran coming back and starting a fast food place. That's pretty awesome. As far as attention to detail, most of our orders have been, been good good so far. The fries have been hot every time. We've just had one hot dog that was a little, uh, not not the quality, but that, that's whatever. We still gave that hot dog a good review. Oh, the individual components really delicious. Ah, the, the blessed bag fries. No, there's two of them. Okay, I'm <laughs> I'm out of it, people. Woo! Okay, so today we are actually going after the patty melts. I'm not sure what my lid is, so I guess... They didn't have any straws. They were actually out there waiting on their truck for that. Nature conservation it is, though. So, uh, this looks freaking delicious and cinematic. Ba-ba-ba-boom! It's yep. Swiss cheese, grilled onions, and their famous uh, steak, bur uh, steak burger patties. Yep. Oh, and they got the grilled onions in it. Mm -hmm. You can smell the caramelization. Alright. So... There's a reason we've been aggressively reviewing Freddy's, and that's because I, I can say we're fans at this point. We've had, we've gone through about what half their menu, mm -hmm. uh, three, four, yeah, uh, yeah, Almost one third, happy. yeah, one third to a half, and it's been banger after banger. <laughs> mm -hmm. I like Freddy's so much, this will probably be the per first place that we kind of finish all of their menu. Because one, it's a it's a pretty focused menu. They have a, they have a few chicken I items, um, but most of it is just, you know, it's the burgers, it's the steak burgers and ice cream that have like the most things. And then the, the chicken is obviously there, but it's like, I don't know. It, it's, it's grilled chicken. Hmm? Chicken sandwich or spicy chicken sandwich. Those are your three chi and the chicken tenders. That's it. So we are going to review it. And at this point, I wouldn't be surprised if everything on their menu is a banger. Like, yeah. <laughs> Most generally, like there, there are there are little rules rules I like to have for fast food places. One. If you call yourself, if you call yourself a uh, steak burger and custard place, your steak, your steak burger and custard better be banger, and it is. And this is another great one. The onions are cooked to perfection. This rye bread is delicious. They toast their buns too, but this rye bread, I, in my opinion, is even, is even better. So, I'm I'm gonna just hit it strong. I, every, yeah, everything we said said about the previous bur burgers being good stays true here. The patty's nice, cor coarsely ground, and it's got the it's got the crispy bits at the end. This rye bread is toasted and golden brown. 
just like you want it. Yeah. This is a 10 out of 10 burger. I don't think there's anything that could, they, anything they could do differently would be a side grade. Or down burger. Yeah. I do love how everything just melts together. The car ones are not like, you know, of on that California burger uh, where it's just like this is an onion. The onions are very caramelized, very tender. It blends so well together, and like this is really good. Like, yes, you're gonna get some like oil on your <laughs> grease or oil on your hands, but I kind of expect that from this because it is literally a patty melt. And so far, I will say this is the best patty melt I've ever had. Mm hmm. Yeah, I've I've had some good patty melt melts in my, my days. To get better than this, you have to go much higher up at a price point. Like, I, I had one at a, a cafe in Virginia that I can't remember the name of off the top of my head. But, yeah. It, it, it's competing with things I have nostalgia for. So, yeah. It is a 10 out of 10. I agree, 10 out of 10. Um, I really can't see anything that you would need to add to this. Um... Hey, Brady Jr., you know, if you want to make us a double, it'll be an, it'll be an interesting idea. But all in all, like, it's, it's really good. And you know, it's like you really can't taste the onions. Like when you eat the onions, like, you really can't taste it. But the onion flavor and everything's there. It's just, I know it's weird for me to say that, but like, you're not getting like a mouthful of just onion taste. And caramelized onions, like, because everything blends together so well, it's just nothing overpowers the other. Mm -hmm. It sure. complements it, and onions have a really, have, like, the perfect texture that go, to go with the beef. So, when yeah. you're biting into it, it isn't like, it isn't like, it isn't like you're eating a patty melt around a hockey puck of onion. Yeah. Which, the hockey puck of onion, I mean, we've talked, talked about it a lot, but it is really good. It's just, we did we didn't expect it, so it's like, Bam! Just big mouthful of onion. And this is a big mouthful of onion too, but it's melty and delicious and goes perfectly with everything done. Like this was, yeah. Now as, as for it, like if, if you're on a diet, you might want to skip, or you're, you're grease conscious, it's it's a bunch of butter and grease. And so be aware of that, but that for, for us that's in the pro category because that's what they advertised. It's like, don't go to a rock show if, you, if you're going to complain about the noise. No, don't order a patty melt and be surprised that everything's melt, melty and greasy. Yeah, so, uh, yeah. What would you say is your final word on this, baby? I just really love how, like, nothing is overpowering. I really, I really love that. Yeah, that's it. Yep. What are your final words? 10 out of 10 burger. Keep it up, Fred Freddy's. You're quickly becoming our favorite fast food place. I'm Brian Pond. Amanda. And we will see y'all next time. Bye-bye.